Alrighty, Lumberjacks, welcome back to another new mod introduction here. Uh, again, this is an older mod that uh, we had out earlier on uh, in 2017, but it's uh, been redone and remastered, and it's uh, definitely back in the ranks again today. So this is the Wheeled Feller Buncher. Uh, I've had a pretty big uh, request to get this guy back up and running. So yeah, we got the... Uh, Good old wheel feller buncher back up and running. Uh, it's got lots of new suspension changes. It's uh, the uh, the head on it here is equivalent to the other bunchers now, so it actually uh, picks up those logs pretty good. Uh, I'll give you a little introduction here. So you got lots of different views. You got your in cab stuff, so you can see around if that's what you're into. Um, this is the uh, head camera that was actually on the original one. Lots of people liked. Um, you can rotate your head left or right. I usually just keep it nice and even if I don't need to do too many changes. <clears throat> or you can just, you know, go from outside the cab as well, uh, going around. So like I said, this one's got a little bit more suspension than the other one does, so you can see it kind of has a little bit of fluctuation when you back up and go forward. Not a lot, but a lot more than the other one used to have. So we're going to be cutting from this position. Uh, you can always turn your saw up to make sure you go. I hit B, turn it on. So like I said, it, it's pretty much just like a buncher, just the uh, difference is you can go in and actually, um, you know, use the wheels wheels as opposed to uh tracks so it's definitely a lot quicker and depending on your style of bunching um it's definitely uh, a whole nother world some people like i'm really good at using the other buncher i'm not like terrible at this but i know some people are like incredibly crazy at this thing i find this to be way better for areas where the trees are much further apart kind of like what we're doing right here um if you got the trees really close together i find it's still a little bit easier with the other buncher but that's you know, entirely personal preference there. What you want to do. Uh, let's see here. These are actually pretty big trees, so it's uh, making it pretty uh, pretty easy to chop them down. You get into the lighter stuff, it might be a little trickier, but, you know, you'll learn your technique. Again, I can't pile uh, anywhere near as good as I can with the other buncher, but it's still uh, a really quick way to clear trees in comparison to the other one if you're uh, looking to change things up a little bit. So yeah, like I said, I don't have to give you too long a tutorial. This gets really addictive, though. I love driving around with this thing. It's pretty fast and uh, pretty fast and does require a little bit of technique, but it's definitely a lot easier than uh, trying to use that other buncher if you're new to bunching. Just kind of all you gotta do is walk up, grab it, and drop it. But uh, yeah, anyway, uh, I don't really need to give you too much more of an introduction on this guy, as you guys know exactly what they are and what they do. So I'll shut her down here. Um, but yeah, so that's the Wheel Feller Buncher. It's in this nice uh, John Deere green color here with the yellow on yellow. Uh, I think you guys will be uh, pretty happy with this guy when she does come out. Um, it's got a lot of a lot of fun stuff going on. So yeah, if you guys uh, like the content, definitely leave a like, leave a comment. Uh, hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. And we'll catch you guys on the next one. See ya.